The fall sports season ending on Saturday with the Midwest Athletic Conference claiming two of the three state football title games played that day. But did any of those highlights make our countdown? We'll find out now in our Leifeld Welding Top 5 Plays. Number five comes to us from our broadcast game. Christian down two to Parkway, 7.9 seconds left. Inbounding, Taylor Zwiebel gets it back to Brock Bowman. He fires for three. Temple Christian goes up by one with 2.5 seconds on the clock. That leads us nice to number four. Panthers looking for the beater. 2.5 seconds, Austin Dennis in the baseball pass, tipped by Bram Barna, and Matt Heindel gets it to go at the buzzer parkway. Wins 47-46. Number three, another buzzer beater from a broadcast game. Allen East and Shawnee tied in overtime, last four seconds. Trey Brock coast to coast, and it goes. Another buzzer beater you saw Saturday. Look at the fan in the bottom right corner of your screen. She's gonna come up, do a little cartwheel for you as Shawnee wins at Allen East. Number two, the Division Seven State Championship football game. Adam Berkey and the Marion Local Flyers looking for their third straight title. Berkey throws to J.C. Miller on the screen. He was hurt in last year's state title game. He is fine for this year. Touchdown, 19 yards out. Flyers win 33 0 back to back to back state titles. And finally, earlier in the day there in Maslin, Brody Hoy and darting in and out of the defenders and down the sideline. 32 yard touchdown to cap off his day as they win back to back state titles in Division 5 for the first time in school history. Hoying over 220 yards all purpose, three touchdowns in a 24 7 win. Great state championship edition of our top five plays of the week.